Hey, welcome back everybody. Today we're gonna to do another quick unboxing. We've got another Civivi product that I've received that I have not had a chance to open yet, so I'm excited to get into it and see what it's all about. So, without further ado, Vivi has nice pouches that they send their knives in for sure, and it comes complete with that cleaning cloth. I know I mentioned it each time, but uh, those are they're pretty cool details. You don't get that with every brand. And it's especially cool because Civivi is a very economical brand. So there you have it, the Civivi Altus. This is a button lock knife. It's got a black hand rubbed Damascus blade on that. It's a flat ground blade. Uh, kind of has that leaf type shape. So it's got a neat looking uh, blade on it. it. It does have jimping on the top, provides grip. It's got a decent feel to it. And the uh, green micarta and the black hardware, even the liner is black. So you've got this green and black uh, theme going that just looks pretty neat on that. It is going to be uh, tip up carry and it is going to be reversible. It has caged ceramic ball bearings so it's very smooth. The clip seems pretty strong. I do notice again that the clip is mounted on top of the scales which is really not my favorite thing. It uh, just doesn't look as good as if it was recessed. Whether that's actually going to get in the way when you're putting it in your pocket or not I don't know but I do notice that. Uh, the centering there you go, the centering is good on that. Definitely a unique looking little knife, like the color combination. Uh, I like the design on that. First impressions are good, I do, I do like it. The button lock is, is actually pretty neat. I think I'm gonna be able to get used to that. It's, uh, I find myself reaching for that liner lock, um, but that won't, that won't take long once you get used to that button there. That's actually pretty nice. Well, there you have it, the Civivi Altus button lock. I may just like it. I'll carry this thing around for a couple weeks and we'll put this in queue for a review at a later time. Meanwhile, I'd like to say thank you very much for watching this video. If you have not subscribed to our channel already, please consider doing so. And consider liking this video as well and leave me a comment. All that helps me in the, uh, the good old YouTube algorithm. And so uh, any help that I can get would be much appreciated. Thanks again for watching. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. God bless.